doing some grinding work on this 10 inch F2 primary mirror. I'm using a grinding tool that's made from ceramic tile and dental plaster. It's about an inch thick, inch and an eighth maybe. And uh, right now I'm on 12 micron micro grit. So I've got a little on there and we're going to do a wet by hand. Uh, this mirror blank was pre-generated at Newport Glass and it has a very good curve on it. So I started grinding this with 25 micron micro grit and I did about 20 minutes by hand with that and now I've switched over to 12 micron and I'll do uh, roughly 20 minutes with 12 as well. The pre-generation job on this was very good. Uh, the target radius was 40 inches and the generation came out uh, something around 40.35 so just a little long there. Uh, I'm grinding now with the tool on top to shorten, uh, excuse me, to lengthen that out just a little bit more because this is such a short focal length mirror, uh, F2, that when it comes time to parabolize, that will shorten the radius quite a little bit. So my target will be to get it up to about 40.5 inches radius during the grinding stage here and then during parabolization to bring it back down to end up right on the 40 inch mark. Uh, for grinding here, because the generation job is so good, they use a diamond generator, it's very smooth, all I need to use is 25 micron, then 12 micron, and I finish with 9 micron. Uh, there, there's so much deepening on this that you don't have to do an excellent polishing job with the rough polishing because there's so much deepening during parabolization that, ha that helps the polishing as well. So kind of interesting working on these super fast mirrors. Uh, these sessions with the uh, grinding are actually fairly short. Uh, the quality of the gin is so good that you don't need much time on it. There's not much subsurface damage. So basically you grind long enough to get a good sphere and to get rid of all of the grinding marks from the either the generation or the previous uh, abrasive level. And once you've done that, you're ready to go. So after a little more grinding, we'll be ready to polish.